Hey guys, Adam here, aka CastleRock15, and welcome to the next part of my Let's Play of Tony Hawk Underground 2. And this is not the remix version. And our first uh, real stop is at Brutal Boston. Road trip. Gas station burritos plus a van cram with dudes. Nothing like a 90 mile an hour Dutch oven. So you ready to get rolling? Start off by I'm pretty sure a Dutch oven would involve a bed as well. What the hell have you guys been getting up to in that van? Mark your territory. He's not injured. Look, his eyes are wide open. Dance, sucker. Come and see me when you're ready to move on. And then this is actually the first time you actually get introduced to uh, a series uh, of your promates. So you have the choice of either Bob Burnquist. Rodney Mullen, Chad Muska, and Mike Vallelli. Or Mike V, in case uh, you have difficulty pronouncing that. Uh, and, of course, each character actually comes with their own stat. So, for instance, uh, Bob Burnquist's uh, very uh, characteristics is a strong with speed and switch. And then, uh, but his run and ollies are, like, down a few stars. And then with Rodney Mullen, his switch and manual are great, however his speed lacks, and so on and so forth. So you have the choice of what character you want to pick, but for uh, an obvious reason, I'm going to pick Bob Burnquist for this. you probably take a wild guess why, but I'm going to uh, let you find out for yourself. Actually, you know what? To be fair, you know what I'm going to do, guys? I'm actually going to uh, bring the audio back for this. I know I said I would, but you know what? I'll have, I'll just have it at, say, 2 or something, you know? Just so it doesn't sound too dull. Because, I mean, in the end, like, uh, as long as, you know, I keep on talking and all, you know... No, I'm not. I'm just stealing a kid. My god, Tony Hawk is the cure for everything! You banked your first point. I'm right beside you! Why did you have to text me, fool? Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Hawk. Please do not injure that kid again. <laughs> Get your own drink, dammit! Jesse James! I'm not paying for your tab. Okay, we've got uh, Jesse James on the team, but we're going to hold out for him in a while because I actually do want to uh, finish off. Well, actually, to not, to la not gonna lie, we actually have to do some of his levels uh, before we can even... We'll have to do some of his missions before we can even unlock that last one there. So, but first I want to get as many of uh, my missions uh, done as possible. So, uh, let's start off with uh, the whole spat uh, findings. What do you have to say? What is it, stranger? You don't have to say twice. Because I am such a rebel. With my stopwatch and my... Uh, bending the rules of uh, going off my skateboard when I shouldn't be. And then I say to them, You're not my lawyer. Whoops. Four or five. Eh, while we're here, let's get these uh, statues. Decapitated. Decapitation! And then uh, one more uh, statue of head coming off. Come on, I want to take his head off! Yay! 
Um, what I do also like is that uh, you actually have the option to. Of course, it wouldn't be a world destruct. Well, it wouldn't. Uh, well, I was gonna say. I guess what I could say now is, it wouldn't be a world destruction tour without a fiery death, but it wouldn't be a world destruction tour without actual destruction of places of the world. Drum roll, please. Thank you. Hmm. I wonder if uh, a few people had several questions that day. Why did we leave a full uh, TNT barrels on that area of the construction site? Hmm. Right. Boombox. Trick to the beat. Do do do. Because real pro skaters actually dance with uh, beats you. Ow! And of course we flip out. Hey, I just done a pop shot. And let's start this off with a McTwist. I'm gonna do that. Yes! Kick flip under heel, but first, McTwist. Oh, okay. Uh, what was I doing beforehand? Oh, yes, I was looking for the. Uh, well, I was getting hit by a car, but. There we go, there's uh, another Mark Your Territory, and we got a text message from Bam Margera. What do you get when you blast a fire hose at a bunch of drunks through an electric fence? 100 points for my team! Top that, sucker! Ha ha ha! Yes, I know, my Bam Margera impression needs work done. What are you gonna do? Wow! Uh, take credit. When in doubt, if uh, you don't know what you just done, take credit for it. And we've unlocked Benjamin Franklin? Um, aren't you, like, supposed to be... Um, in a Marvel magazine or something? Ah, uh, forget. Right. Uh, that, uh, that's, uh... Sorry, I just want to play a game of this. And... So we've just got to do this. I'm just listening to some of the lyrics in the background there, and I'm like, um, what? But to be fair, like, um, some of the soundtrack in this, uh, in this game, I actually do have a guilty pleasure for. Like, uh, there's one, uh, I used in an animation, uh, uh, like a few years back, uh, called Deadly Sinners by Three Inches of Blood. I think the name of the song is. All I just know is that, uh, the band is, uh, uh, that, that is, I think it's their name, but either way, uh, the name of the song is Deadly Sinners. That's all I know. Uh, yeah, and so I used that in an animation of mine. It was actually a uh, remake or remastered version of the very first Lego animation I'd done for Castle Rock 15, uh, Lego Skater Guy Accident. Uh, if you get a chance, uh, go check it out. Uh, both I wouldn't recommend the original, but uh, if you want, like, uh, for the sake of nostalgia, uh, by all means, go on ahead. Uh, whereas with uh, the uh, remastered version, it's sort of uh, a remake, but this was like around the time when I was using my camcorder, and of course, all <laughs> the big mistake with the uh, animator is always uh, make sure your settings are set to manual, which uh, of course means uh, the uh, lighting and the focus and whatnot. So, um, yeah, I kind of slacked in that field.
but uh, besides that, uh, that's us pretty much done with our goals for me, or as the game points at you. What, me or you? You. Oh, okay. So it's me. No, it's you. What? <laughs> so we've got combo on the ramp is the last thing, but like I said, we need to uh, unlock the... We actually have to play as Jesse to uh, do this. And why not? What's because that, Slick? I do like that, though. Like, uh, whenever you're making a transaction, and if you say, like, if you're off your board, there's actually a brief scene where... Uh, you know, it, like he's holding the his vehicle there, which is the uh, Segway. Well, the motorized Segway is really like I mean, out of all like the guest characters you have in this game, uh, Jesse James is my favorite just because of this vehicle, and also uh, the possibly the next stage as well. But hey, now we get to race Polly. Well, if you actually do approach Polly um, as, say, you or your pro skater or Benjamin Franklin, then you will get, like, a message saying, uh, Hey, there's no way you could beat me on my uh, vehicle of choice, man. So uh, you'd have to play as JC James just to rub it in his face. Hip transfer. And what I do like is, uh, with Jesse James, unlike the other uh, special characters... Oh, well there you go. After you get to a certain point, uh, you'll get an infamous text message from uh, Tony or your leader stating, uh, you know, that you can move on to the next stage. But, uh, you know what, like I said in the last part, uh, Along with the training level, this was also um, another level I was going to 100%. So uh, we'll actually continue on with a few other wee bits and pieces. So for the next mission, what you want to do is... Well, what you want to do is not that. You want to jump three cars in particular. So we've jumped that one. Don't jump that, don't bother with that one, because that one's a nuisance to go over the uh, T-boat or whatever. And then sometimes the angle is a wee bit tricky to get right. And then after that, uh, you actually unlock the uh, RV, and so with that, we can now finish my character's, uh, characters, or my character's uh, stats, or goals. So we'll have to um, do a combo, I don't know what the number is, but uh, eh, let's keep it like so, so uh, that our stats will increase. Um, okay, what what is actually the combo? Start and land a 200 point combo, oh, okay. Ah, damn it. That would have been a sweet. Ah, oh, there we go. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure if I was seeing the other one, but uh, you actually wind up, uh, you know, the board rolls up to you, and then you actually, in a temper, like, stomp on it. Uh, you know what? Oh, alright. We'll unlock uh, Benjamin Franklin. Move called the Franklin. The Franklin grind. And I thought he copyrights that. Or Marvel copyrights it. Who knows? Wait. Has it been taken yet? Mine! Slaps a trademark sticker on it. So, what's the plan then? We need to... All about the Benjamin skating liberty. Okay, so let's uh, do what uh, every pro skater would probably violently, what any uh, person would like to do. Destruction! Ah, Not the destruction I wanted to do. Yes! 
I like that jazzy music they play. Especially when you enter a... Oh, excuse me for your honor. When you enter a new area. Especially here, uh, which I'll actually show off. You shush me. Of course, you actually get shushed and uh, there's no music whatsoever when you enter the library. Hmm, I wonder what happens with this. Oh my god, it's the void! And of course, ironically enough, it wouldn't exactly be a Tony Hawk underground game without actually being an underground. <laughs> Ow. I hate that though, like, uh, especially here, like, like, you're gonna, like, uh, when we, uh, went off to get, uh, Jesse James, uh, you wind up, uh, like, you could actually see, oh, uh, interact a cutscene with him standing in the actual bar of Jeers, but what I hate about it is, you know, like, uh, it's only an in-game cutscene and, like, there's no way to access it, so... Alright, so with that, let's uh, get the other. So, what we want is skip the liberty, do a pop, shove it, then vert transfer. Then, next thing we have to do is vert transfer this. And then, let's infiltrate the tea party! Yeah, we're badass! Oh, killed two birds with one stone. I keep on forgetting about that one. But, you know, just to put the icing on the cake, make twist all the way. And then, of course, uh, we actually now a team challenge now where we have to use both. Uh, so, that we have to actually do a team challenge. We have to kick flip near that skitter that just passed us. Okay, so one of three blade kickers. So with that, I think we've, uh, so far, that's all really we can do without Benji here. So uh, let's switch back to good old Castle Rock. And uh, finish uh, our wee part. Actually, before we move on to Bob, I think I may have left out a mission for, uh, from Jesse. Where the hell did Skater Blade Runner go? Hey, you! Watch me do a kickflip. I said watch me do a kickflip, not again my... There we go. Blade Hopper. So yeah, we'll uh, go to Jesse here. I the kill the grind blockers. Because if you actually uh, try this with uh, another character, like a pro skater or whatever, um, you'll actually uh, trip and deal. Hey, <laughs> Alright, Jet, what the hell are you doing? There we go. I almost thought that's uh, done with Jesse here. And now let's. All right, time for the Brazilian action. That's cool. You actually see uh, Bob there, uh, full on, um, skating like uh, like in the style of Jesse there. No. Okay, let's sing. Hey, you're here. And with that, that's uh, that mission done. So we need a sticker slap uh, with Bob. Uh, ten new skit signs because screw the rules. You're not the boss of us. Unless, of course, uh, it's an action bunnies uh, scenario where it says don't stay off the grass. Then uh, by all means, stay off the grass. Because if you uh, disobey that sign, you will be uh, disrayed and be turned into a skeleton. 
So yeah, funny enough, uh, whenever you unlock the uh, the ramp, uh, um, it dis uh, the three other cars disappear, but the only vehicle that remains behind is the Tea Party boat, which uh, of course would make uh, sense because it's actually a mission here. And what I liked there was uh, whenever you wind up, whenever you wind up uh, sketching the car, you can actually see the uh, r RV ramp uh, actually pick up speed. That's metals. <laughs> You know what, I'm not gonna lie, you see uh, when they first uh, said that, I thought they were talking as in the big poster behind him, until I realized that was that was actually a poster of Tony Hawk. Excuse me! I'll run you over. And of course, uh, you do you still have your throwing items, so there we go. <laughs> Two for one. So what's the last missions for Bob? Uh, so we've got every mission for the others. Last thing to do is salute the general, slap the signs, and tag the billboard. I think we'll save the tag the billboard for last. Uh, I th usually the uh, commands change for... Oh, no, I actually noticed that there. You can actually change your pro skater uh, in that. If you if you choose to do it. Aye, because... Aye, so there you go. Because uh, in some cases, because of the pro... Depending on the pro skater, I guess. Um, you, some of the uh, grab tricks will be different. Uh, so... As normally what would happen is if I was a custom skater or Castle Rock 15, uh, what would happen would be is that uh, Airwalk would be, uh, you know, like, uh, just like south east, point the, uh, press the down and uh, side button uh, as well as the yeah, circle button. Whereas with the uh, Pro Skater, all you have to do is just hit down and circle. Sort of makes it easier, but uh, yeah, I th really think they. I really wish they would keep the controls the same though. There we go. All we just have to do now is uh, do the cleanup and get the final missions, and then. So that's three or four things. There we go. There it is. That's the freak out I like. Actually, I think there's one where you, like, really freak out. Um, I think it's with um, Mike V. Um, they takes his board and actually smashes it over his, uh, over his head. Uh, I find that really funny. Like, that they have, like, different levels of how you freak out for each character. Actually, I think the thing is, like, one of them actually smacks it over, smashes it over their face, and then you can actually see them, like, hold cup in their face, like, going, oh, why the hell did I do that? It, wasn't, it was a, seemed like a smart idea in my head. And with that, the last mission, of course, is the <coughs> tag the billboard, sorry. I've actually recorded, uh, this part, and, uh, the training mission all in one video, so my voice is starting to get a wee bit raspy here, guys. Okay, take a wee break. Oh, I'm also tired, man. You know, a fun fact is yawning is contagious. I bet you, you're yawning right now. Beautiful. And with that, you'll get a text message from uh, Mr. Hawk. And that text message will read, Wow, we've completed every possible goal in this level. Let's move on to the next city. And then with all that, uh, 
Yeah, that's really everything you can do. Uh, missions are done. So, uh, like I said, guys, uh, oh, you know what? Let's approach as me. So, with that said, um, that's the, this is all I'm doing, you know, 100% wise, uh, this level and the last. Uh, from here on out, uh, you'll just see a few missions I'll be doing, and then, uh, yeah, we'll uh, go by that. But, uh, yeah, guys, thanks for hanging about, and uh, I'm going to leave you off with this uh, cutscene, and I will see you next part. See ya. Thug is filmed before a live studio audience. Donna, your rack is wicked awesome. Stop it! You're retarded. No, you are! Oh! oh. <laughs> nice catch, dumbass! Yes! I'm just doing that chick a favor! <laughs> You're retarded! <laughs> Yo, check it out. The first stage of the competition is over, and leading by 50 points is... My team. Yeah! Oh, right. Holy oh. crap, it's Polly! Oh, yeah, look out! Poop are going through! Please keep your hands inside the corner body while you take a drink, bitch! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was Whoa. awesome! Oh, man, look at that. <laughs> Give me that pad. Launch a local. That's 100 points, slackers. And that's a win for us. Which also means it's time for you losers to face the Wheel of Loogie. Phil, why don't you do the honors, fat boy? Okay. <laughs> Cut one loose. Ouch. That means one of us is going home. Damn, damn, we'll Tony's to team, we'll circle up around me and let's see who's getting the boot. If I could leave our soon-to-be departed skater with just one final word, it would be... FIRE IN THE HOLE! <laughs> that sucks. Bing! <laughs> Later, Birdquist! Everybody else, let's hit it! We're heading to Spain! Yeah, I'm driving!